The Revenant made headlines earlier this year for DiCaprio's Oscar-winning performance, but one of the lesser-discussed topics was the film's depiction of Native American genocide. The Revenant is a semi-autobiographical movie of the life of Hugh Glass who lived in the early 1800s. Yet, there is no evidence that Hugh Glass had a Native American wife, let alone a mixed-race son. However, these fictitious characters allow the movie to engage in the larger discussion of the status and fate of Native Americans and their offspring. This film draws attention to the atrocities committed against Native Americans. Not only was their race considered inferior and subhuman by European settlers, they were also murdered in large numbers, thus leading to genocide. Why? Was he playing with his little boy's mama? Huh? It's Gerald! Glass's mixed race son, Hawk, was referred to as a savage and a dog and expected to receive such treatment without opposition so as to stay alive, albeit in an inferior position to the Europeans. While the abuse, cruelty and enormous violations of fundamental human rights sustained by Native Americans is not the primary theme of The Revenant, it is an important underlying theme such that Hawk's murder fuels Glass's thirst for revenge. Thereby, The Revenant brings much needed awareness to the topic of Native American genocide. Oh, my God.